All right, hi YouTube. The purpose of this, uh, and this is presidential tourist, by the way. I'm gonna add this to the video where I filmed at the Electric Umbrella. It's a restaurant that's located at Epcot at Disney. I did talk about some of the food, and um, I did some filming around there. I did show the menu, but I wanted to go over it and uh, let you know what the menu says. And of course, if you have any questions about it, um, feel free to ask. Uh, this is what they have for the menu for the Electric Umbrella. It's located at Epcot at Walt Disney World. Okay, the first one, number one, which is the one I got to eat, it was the French Dip Burger. It is $13.29, so it's a bit expensive. But it does come with fries and apple slices. It's the one third pound Angus Burger brisket, crispy onions and Munster serve apple slices and French fries. It was good, but I don't know if it was worth 13 something. I see, I know there's a lot of people getting that. Number two, which is the one third Angus uh, bacon cheeseburger, which was twelve dollars and twenty nine cents, and that's also served with um, apple slices and French fries. The next one, number three, was energy energy salad with roasted chicken, which was ten forty nine. Includes seasonal fruit, feta, and pine nuts, and I did see quite a few people getting that. Number four was the vegetarian flatbread, nine ninety nine, tomato pesto base topped with mushrooms, feta. Mozzarella and ar argilla, which I almost got that myself. I did see a few people again. It did look good, but it's not that big. Number five is sausage and pepper sandwich, which was ten forty nine. Italian sausages, chunks, peppers, onions, tomato, and provolone served with apple slices and French fries. The next thing was six chicken breast nuggets, eight pieces, ten forty nine, served with apple slices and French fries. And number seven, they had a veggie sandwich. Which was ten forty nine, uh, broccoli saw, andami, and tofu wasabi dressing served with apple slices and French fries. Of course, they had a variety of desserts. All of them it looked pretty small and it was pretty expensive. Strawberry cheesecake four twenty nine, mixed fruit cup three seventy nine, chocolate cupcake four fifty nine, no sugar added brownie four nineteen, and it wasn't that big. I seen one. Beverages, of course, they have the fountain drinks like Coca-Cola, uh, Sprite, Fanta, um, Minute Maid, uh, Lemonade, I think. Yeah, then they had iced tea, which I didn't notice until I was almost out because I would have got that instead instead of the lemonade. They had the Gold Peaks flavor, which is the best, I think, and I would have got the unsweet one. They had a sweet one as well. That, now, the drink is three twenty-nine, and then they had a Fanta Frozen Blue Raspberry Slushy. Three ninety nine, a Minute Maid strawberry slushy, three ninety nine, a frozen pineapple coconut slushy, three ninety nine. They did have a bottle of water, which was three dollars. It's um, Dasani, I think it was. I wrote all this down. Uh, coffee, regular decaf, hot tier hot cocoa, two forty nine. Heineken, seven fifty. Bud Light, six seventy five. Strawberry margarita, nine seventy five. Woof. Pina Colada, eight seventy five. Then they had kid meals for guests ages nine under. And all meals included Danian uh, Dynamo smoothie, apple slices, and choice of small low fat milk or small deciding water. You had a uh, grilled chicken wrap, which was five ninety nine. Vegetarian flatbread, five ninety nine. Cheeseburger, six forty nine. Macaroni and cheese, five ninety nine. And you could sub some of these things with small Nesquik chocolate milk, cherry gelatine, French fries, or cookies. That was the main menu. Now what's good also there, they had an allergy friendly menu, so I guess if you were like gluten and you had to eat gluten free food, you'd have some options. Gluten wheat allergy friendly, this was the one third pound Angus bacon cheeseburger served with an allergy friendly bun. Uh, allergy friendly chicken strips and then the energy salad, which is all um, gluten wheat f um, good for you. And of course the kids meals which was served with um, uh, apple slices. You have the cheeseburger one, the allergy friendly chicken strips, and allergy friendly macaroni, macaroni and cheese. And desserts, um, you had uh, cookies and brownies which is all good. And then um, egg allergy friendly, uh, the one third pound egg is French dip burger which the, all these were served with french fries or fruit cup. Uh, one third Angus bacon cheeseburger, um, sausage and pepper sub, veggie sandwich, energy salad with seasonal fruit and chicken, allergy friendly chicken strips. That's for the egg friendly one. And of course, desserts 
for that was allergy friendly cookies, kids meals, serve apple slices again, his chicken wrap, the cheeseburger, and allergy friendly chicken strips. Now they had soy friendly, allergy friendly ones too. The one third pound Angus bacon cheeseburger served an allergy friendly bun, energy salad with seasonal fruit and chicken, allergy friendly chicken strips, and of course the dessert that falls under the soy one was friendly cookies, and of course kid meals which serve apple slices, hamburger, and allergy friendly chicken strips. They also had a fish shellfish uh, allergy friendly, and I mentioned how their location doesn't work with fish or shellfish, so you're pretty well safe. Um, then of course the desserts, they were all good under that one, the friendly, uh, cookies, the brownies, the cheese cakes, and the cupcake, and the kid meal. And they're all okay with all, uh, with um, fish, shellfish, allergy friendly because they don't deal with that, so all of them are good. Then a milk allergy friendly one, which is a one third um, pound bacon burger, which these are served with french fries or fruit cup, allergy friendly chicken strips, and the dessert, that's milk allergy friendly, was cookies, the kid meal one, of course, like I said, serve apple slices that are milk allergy friendly. Chicken wrap, hamburger, energy friendly chicken strips. And peanut tree nut allergy friendly, which is served with french fries or fruit cup. The ones that fall under this one one third pound Angus French dip burger, one third pound bacon cheeseburger, allergy friendly chicken strips, and the desserts uh, friendly uh, cookies, friendly brownies, and the kids' meals, which serve apple slices again. Chicken wrap, cheeseburger, allergy friendly, chicken strips. So that is pretty much uh, the regular menu and the allergy free menu that they have there. With regard to the restaurant itself, eh, it wasn't really too impressive looking. I mean, comp I guess with some of um, the signs that were kind of cool, but the architecture for it, I didn't find it really that exciting. I mean, like, um,. Not like compared to like that sci-fi dining theater, which is really cool. But the electric umbrella, I mean, it's not too special. They had places for you to eat inside and out, and then they had a second floor where you can go eat at too. That was kind of cool, but I think they could have had a little bit more decoration inside. I mean, it's not too bad. I'll eventually probably eat there again, but i got to get through all the other restaurants. I, I plan to eat at every restaurant at Disney and do a video on it and then tell you what I think maybe even each food stand too so you know I got a lot to get through but that was the Electric Umbrella restaurant which is located at Epcot at Walt Disney World I went and ate there um, last Wednesday I don't remember what the exact date September something so if you, if you were there who knows you might have seen me and I, like I said I filmed around the restaurant I went upstairs to the second floor I showed a little bit outside I filmed the menu I filmed the food I had and I took a picture of it and um, I mean that's pretty much it if you have any comments or questions about um, the electric umbrella uh, let me know please please put them below I'm always happy to answer your questions and I look forward to talking to you again soon YouTube bye everybody bye and at the electric umbrella restaurant I'm not sure what I'm going to get. I'll let you know. I want to show you the menu. And then they have a... Um, allergy free one. Pretty cool. Alright, I'm going to order and I'll show you what I got. And I got the French dip um, burger. It comes with apple slices and fries. It was $13.29. I bought a medium drink, which was $3.29. And I already tell you, it looks delicious. Alright, see you in a minute. I have the French dip burger thing they have here. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Delicious. I just had a bite. I'm going to try a fry on camera. Mmm. Right. This was at the Electric Umbrella. It's right across um, by uh, Mouse Gear, the uh, gift shop. And um, pretty close to one uh, where Innovations is. All right. 
Um, this is a quick one. I'll try to do a little bit of filming in the restaurant and show you what it looks like after I'm done eating. All right, bye. about that one you can get unlimited refills some restaurants you can't do that you only get the one re or one cup full and that's it and then upstairs I think see what the upstairs looks like I guess it's for the outside for it. This is the electric umbrella. Not too bad. I've seen them, um, or I've been to better ones here, I think. Go into the other entrance. Let's see. Yeah. Here we are. Where the electric umbrella is, that restaurant. Okay, now my question is, do you know what we're going to use? We're going to go to the restaurant.